<laughs> well, so you're looking forward, are you ready for the Olympics? Are you ready for the Olympics? Yeah. We're not, we're not. <laughs> if you thought the Vancouver Olympics was a shambolic waste of money, just wait till you see what London's got planned, eh? <laughs> Oh, I got, to a, I got to an underground train station in London last week. It was closed, right, because of defective escalators. The escalators going down to the train are broken, so we've closed the station. Now, I am no expert in modern transportation systems, but I would have thought a defective escalator just turns into a set of stairs. <laughs> I can do that. I'll use my legs. I've never been on an escalator before that stopped near the bottom, and I've gone, oh, I don't believe it. <laughs> guard, guard, can we sort this out, please? <laughs> yeah, you're angry. Look how close I was. Look. <laughs> Four steps, I was free. I could have gone and warned the others. <laughs> Not ready. Not that we care. In, we don't care about the Olympics in Scotland. Oh, come on. Rowing. Rowing? No one rows in Scotland. If you ever see four guys in a boat in Glasgow, you know one of them's not coming back, right? <laughs> <It's> the... <laughs> we, like, uh, we like our Winter Olympics in Scotland, like you lot. You know, that really plays into our hands. You know, we both share a love of ice curling, the Scots and the Canadians, yeah. <laughs> well, to be honest, you lot should be good at ice curling. It's played on ice, you know. There are parts of Atlantic Canada where that's just a method of putting out the garbage in the morning. You know, just <laughs> open the front door and slide it down the old drive. <laughs> Shit, one of the bags has burst. Come on, three of us, come on, three of us. <laughs> three of us. Three of us. <laughs> but I did, I used to love church. When I was a kid, I used to love it. I used to love listening to the stories, you know, even if they didn't always connect with the Scottish audience. Like the story of Noah and his ark. I was, that used to cause sniggers in a Scottish church, I'll be honest. Because there's no way Noah got a very good reception when he came to Scotland. When you think about what his message was, right? Hello, Scotland. Hello. <laughs> I am Noah. Oh, hello. What can we do for you? I require two of all of your animals. And how are you gonna pay for these? <laughs> I'm not paying for them, Scotland. I'm a messenger of God. Oh, well, this is interesting. What's the message? Scotland, there is to be 40 days and nights of rain. Can you say it again? Can you say it to him, please? That was, oh, Jesus. 40 days and nights of rain. Do you know you're in Scotland? <laughs> We're on 52 at the moment, Noah. <laughs> it's not a great prediction, is it? It's not one of your best. <laughs> Do you know if I'd been Noah, I'd have been a lot more discerning about who got on that ark and who didn't. He had the chance to wipe out entire species of animals. If I'd been Noah right there with the old checklist and I saw two rats coming up that plank. Right? <laughs> I'd have been like, hello. Hiya. Uh, rats. <laughs> uh, two of us. <laughs> We're on the uh, list. No, I'd be like, I don't, I don't see you. <laughs> I, uh, nope, you're not, sorry, you're not that, but no, but we've got an invite. Look, <laughs> rap plus one, that's him, that's that guy. <laughs> I don't care what you've got, go on, get out of here, get lost, go on. You're not down, it's a very strict policy, get out of here, take the mosquitoes with you. <laughs> And the rats are like, oh, but, but, but our entire species 
will be wiped out by the FOD. <laughs> Boo hoo. <laughs> You're a rat. You should have thought about that before you killed half of Europe in the plague. <laughs> Admittedly, not for another 1,400 years. <laughs> I'm a visionary. That's how I got this job. <laughs> Must have been hard, though. How does Noah know? Because so many animals, you know, all these things coming up there. <laughs> what are you? Um, I'm an uh, anteater. <laughs> anteater. Oh, right, OK. Just check the list. It's two anteaters. Yes, there you go. Oh, hang on. I need a word with you two. What? What is it? What, what do we do? <laughs> Don't look all innocent. There's two of everything on that ship, right? If they go missing, <laughs> I know it's you two, all right? <laughs> Nosey's clean, the pair of you. <laughs> two anteaters slope off. Nice going, dickhead. What'd you tell me what anteaters for, you know? Did you just call me a dickhead? <laughs> you... Did you... Did you pass a mirror on the way here, no? And so many animals look the same. That's the other problem Noah had. How do you know who's been on the ark and who hasn't been on the ark, right? You know, when these two things come up, you know, hello, hi, Noah, how you doing? You know, sorry we're late, you know, but we're here now. And Noah's like, oh, my... Oh, hang on a minute. I think I've already got two of you on. No, 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 no. Those guys, yeah, they were stags. We're moose. <laughs> very different, very different. Noah's panics. Oh, my God, I didn't realise so many animals look the same but are different. Someone go and get the black and white horses. Tell them they can come back. Come on. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your night, folks. You've been lovely. Thank you very much.